we've been uh, announcing a couple of pro new products which are dedicated for LTE and uh, 4G uh, network infrastructure uh, uh, environments. And primarily for security applications and uh, uh, packet gateway applications. Um, in the past, typically uh, network equipment manufacturers develop their own hardware. We, we're giving the time to, to market and time to revenue advantage by providing hardware, standard-based hardware to the market where the application can be launched much quicker and uh, the first one who is launching the application makes the more re revenue and has the market advantage. Is this uh, standardized, this part of the market? Are we looking at standards that you're operating to? Are they open standards as well? They are open standards, uh, open hardware standards uh, to uh, define pl platforms for the telecom environment with uh, NEP certification and uh, central office type of uh, certification. Um, so we, we're taking basically the hardware uh, concerns of our customers off our plate so they can focus on the application layer and, uh, and focus on where they, where, where they are best in, uh, in writing the application itself. So in the network side, you're really handling the big data traffic, presumably? That is correct. So uh, we, the hardware standard we're using is uh, the only hardware standard which is uh, supporting more than 40 gigabit Ethernet uh, to the backplane uh, and therefore uh, gives a, the best platform to use in the LTE type of environments. Um, and when you come down to subscriber base uh, uh, increase and uh, a higher bandwidth demand, these type of platforms can give you the advantage to launch your application and uh, be up to speed with the uh, market demand. Now I've been walking around the show and looking at a lot of equipment manufacturers and I see your blades appearing in other people's stands. Why is that? Well, it's probably just the fact that we have a large customer base from a tier 1 to tier 2 and tier 3 type of customers. Uh, the advantage of standard-based hardware is to be reusable, uh, so the bill of material is becoming less expensive uh, for our customers and it's, uh, it's a, a, a larger volume and therefore uh, the, the cost advantage is there for our customers. So some of the big network equipment vendors are using your product as the core of their services as well? That's correct. So uh, we, when you talk about uh, some of the uh, uh, key infrastructure components, um, they, are, they are based on, on the ATCA standard form factor. And we're providing the hardware forward, uh, and especially now with uh, multi-core and 40 gigabit Ethernet support, our partnership with Intel and Carvim has allowed us to, to launch products which are suitable for this type of uh, network application.